Here we're asked to simplify this complicated fraction expression. Okay, so hold your breath. We're going to try and make this as simple as possible. First of all, I'm just going to look at this denominator and simplify it on the side. 1 plus 1 third. Well, that is 3 thirds plus 1 third. That would be 4 thirds. Now I'm going to try and simplify this denominator. 1 plus 1 half. That would be 2 halves plus 1 half equals 3 halves. So let's put those back in now. 1 over 4 thirds minus 1 over 3 halves. And of course, when you take 1 over a fraction, that's called taking the reciprocal of the fraction, that merely flips the fraction over. So 1 over 4 thirds is 3 quarters, and 1 over 3 halves is 2 thirds. So we've enormously simplified the process already. Now it's merely an issue of finding a common denominator. So I'm going to take this first fraction, 4 thirds, and multiply by 3 over 3. And of course, the reason mathematically that we're allowed to multiply by 3 over 3, 3 over 3 is really just 1. So we're not really changing the value of the fraction. Similarly, 2 thirds, I'm going to multiply this by 4 over 4. And so what happens is I get 9 over 12 minus 8 over 12 equals 1 over 12. And this is answer choice D.